Hey guys, so it's me and today I'm going to do a video of a book review which I said I would do yesterday and I'm going to do now. The book I'm going to be reviewing is called Water for Elephants by Sarah Gruen and there is some criticism and there you can see that it says number one bestseller. Um, so we start off with these characters, well character shall I say, and his name is Jacob Jankowski. He is orphaned, penniless and homeless. So then he comes across this moving train and he jumps on it, not knowing what it is, and it's a moving circus. Um, and the movie The Circus is set in the 1930s with the depression and um, prohibition and all of that stuff. So that's really interesting because I, I found that interesting. Uh, for me, anyway. Um, and then we come across these other characters. There's Walter, there's Camel, there's... Marlene in August and all of these characters are completely believable. The main I think theme of this book is um, about animals because the author is very um, involved in animal organisations and stuff like that. Um, also the it changes between chapters of when Jacob's at the moving circus and when he's 93 but it starts when he's 93 and then it keeps going like that in the same sort of order it goes from when he's at the circus to when he's 93 to when he's at the circus to when he's 93 and so on and um, that's really interesting because you can kind of tell his mentality of like whether he's thinking it or whether he's just woken up from a dream of realising that that's all what's happened and I really like this book because as I said before the um, characters are really believable it's set in a time where um, things were a lot different to what they are now and if I was to recommend it in a our system it will be four four and a half stars out of five the reason for that being that I sort of found it a bit too long for my liking so um that'd be the only reason why I'd not give it five stars other than that I thought the plot was really good the characters were really good and I think if you enjoy reading books that have an interesting story in them, then you should definitely go pick up a copy. Alright, I think I've said all of what I need to say, so I'm going to go now. Bye guys.